Hello everyone, my name is Pika and welcome to Circle Time with Iwiz. This is a lesson going to be on my senses. See? Anybody else's spider sense tingling? Now, what exactly are my senses? Senses are things that help you take in and recognize things around you. For example, you are watching me and you are using a sense. You are listening to me. You are using a sense to understand and take in this media. You are able to touch your screen. You are able to touch your remote. You are using senses. You may even be having a snack while you're watching this video and you are using your senses. So what are our senses? We have five different senses. They are touch, see, hear, smell and taste. So these senses have body parts that go with them. Now, what does that mean? Let's put these into sentences. I see with my eyes. I smell with my nose. I hear with my ears. I taste with my tongue. I touch with my hands. Those are the body parts that go with these senses. So let's go over what we've learned so far. We have five senses and they are see, smell, hear, taste and touch. Each of these senses have corresponding or matching body parts, which are our eyes. Our eyes help us to see. Our ears, our ears help us to hear. Our nose helps us to smell. Our tongue helps us to taste. And what exactly do our hands do? Our hands help us to touch. So now we understand the concept of senses and the body parts that go with them. Let's play a little game. Here are five different pictures. Now I want you to help me figure out which sense will help us take the information from these pictures in to our brain. Let's see. This is a very beautiful painting. How would we understand this? We would have to look at it. We would have to look at it to understand that this is a beautiful painting. Now, this is a flower that smells very nice. So, how do we know that it smells very nice? We will have to use our noses to take in the very nice smell. This is a person playing the piano. How can we know that they are playing it? We've got to listen with our ears to hear the music. So what senses have we gone through already? We have gone through sight, seeing with our eyes, hearing, hearing with our ears, smelling, smelling with our nose. What two senses are left? That would be taste and touch. So these are building blocks. These are Legos. We all play with Legos because Legos starts from the age of three, I think, up until adulthood because everyone loves building stuff with Legos. But how do we know which piece goes where? We've got to feel it and put it together. We know it goes together because we feel it click and fits well together. So, what sense will we be using? 
We will be using our touch. We will be using our hands to put the pieces together. How about this tasty looking burger? How will we know that it's tasty? We know that it's tasty only because we can taste it with our tongues. So we will taste the burger with our tongues. That is our senses, how to use them and the body parts that go with them. Now, yes, all of this is really fun and very exciting, but there are also some things that are not as exciting. For example, the disabilities that come with some of these senses. For example, blindness. We hear of blindness very often or even loss of sight where someone's eyesight is not very good and therefore they have to use glasses or contacts. This is a disability that is linked to our sight sense and which is the body part that goes with our sight sense? That would be our eyes. We tend to lose sight or go blind in our eyes. So that is the matching disability to sight. How about deafness? What is deafness? Deafness is the loss of hearing. You may not be able to hear properly. How? Which sense does this affect? This affects our hearing. And what do we hear with? We hear with our ears. Very well done, you all. You're taking this in amazingly. So let's go over what we've learned so far. We've learned about the five senses. We've learned about their body parts. And we've learned about two different disabilities. Let's go over them together, shall we? Very well done. We see with our eyes. We hear with our ears, we smell with our nose, we taste with our tongues, and we touch with our hands. Blindness is when we lose the sense of sight. Deafness is when we lose the sense of hearing. Now, remember, blindness and deafness does not necessarily mean that you cannot see at all or that you cannot hear anything. It also means that you will not be able to see very well or you will not be able to hear very well. Now that we've done all of this and we've learned so much about senses, I think it's time to remember that if you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. But if you're sad and you know it, stomp your feet. Until next time, remember to click like, share and follow us or subscribe to our YouTube channel right here down below. Until next time, goodbye everyone.